What is going on everyone, it is Yarn here, and today I'm bringing you a video where I'll be showing you all the glitches that I've never published on the MWR. Um, I don't know why I never published them. I think I was just too lazy to upload and edit shit. I know I had, a, I know I had them recorded on my PS4, but I saw my PS4 like nine months ago, so. I'll be showing you all of them on uh, COD 4, because I don't feel like buying MWR on PC just for one fucking video, but yeah, they all work on uh, MWR. I'm pretty sure none of them were posted to YouTube because when MWR was out, I was on YouTube like 24 seven. So I'm pretty sure I've never seen these videos on YouTube, but I know a few people that know about them. So if you know about them, don't blame it on me. As I said, I promise that all of these work on MWR and you can try them out for yourself. And then let me know in the comment section if they work for you. I just promise. But yeah, uh, I'll start off with the Chinatown glitch, which is like a solo glitch. You don't need a friend to do it. And um, most of these glitches will be on Chinatown, but anyway. Um, yeah, originally you could uh, you would get up here on the like the spot that I'm going to be showing you with uh, with the sabotage bomb. You would like jump on top of the bomb, then on top of the fence, and then on top of the, uh, the sign. And, but but uh, I found a way how to deal without it, and this is one of those glitches that I'm uh, talking about that I was talking about when I said that some people know it. There's not a lot of people that know about this, but no, no one's ever posted this. I mean, if you, if you guys seen it on YouTube, then just let me know in the comments, I haven't seen it. But yeah, uh, basically there's a barrier uh, around top of the pole, uh, top of that light pole, light pulse, whatever you want to call it. And it's really tricky to get into at first, but once you like, once you get used to it, you'll be able to get it every time, but that's like the easier part of the glitch. Um, basically what you're gonna do after that is uh, just jump around the pole in the way that I do and make sure you're in the same direction uh, as I am because the other direction is not gonna work for some reason but you wanna keep jumping around and you cannot just walk around because the barrier is just super fucking retarded I don't know what but yeah just go the same way as I'm going and then at the end once you come like as far as you can to the end of the barrier just wanna do a quick run jump to the fence or you can just like uh, do like a small strafe or you can do like like a strafe without I don't know I don't <sighs> yeah once you get on the fence you can get on those uh, uh, vents or whatever the fuck those are and on MWR there's like a sign over there uh, next to the balcony and it like goes into the balcony so you can get up there as well and once you're on top of that I'm not sure if you're not feel, well, I don't think you are but you can go all the way inside the balcony and you're like pretty much invisible how good like how oh my fucking god how good of a spot it is so yeah that's free let's get on to another one and this is going to be a uh, like two man glitch or a mantle stack fuck whatever the fuck you want to call it so you guys are basically i mean basically you know how uh basically there is a way and it still works where you rpg delay jump like you delay your rpg jump a lot and you jump up on top of that construction thingy then you fucking strafe jump onto the window then rpg jump rpg strafe onto the pole and then strafe jump onto the balcony then from the balcony oh my god what am i doing with my life then from the balcony you jump onto the windows and then you just fucking run jump onto the construction thingy that that was one way of doing it but this is it uh, included the rpg that was like the the shit way of doing it because you wouldn't need an RPG to do it and there's no way of doing it like in a hide and seek or whatever so I found a way how to do it without it but it's a mental stack two man whatever just don't don't hate me for saying mental stack or two man I don't know what it's fucking called so what you're pretty much going to do is you're going to have a friend that's going to edge out uh, of the window as much as possible uh, it should be the window um, it has to be the window closer to the construction thing and then you're basically going to going to stand in the other window but make sure that there's uh, only one window that's not broken and it has to be the window closest to the construction thingy and every other window should be broken so what you're gonna do your, your friends are gonna stand and edge out of the window that's closer to the construction building construction <sighs> thingy of the building and then you're going to stand in the other window and on, uh, on MWR there's like a thing where you can edge out, it's not a cut for but you can edge out easily. Basically you're gonna edge out and like stand on the edge. 
Oh, I'm so retarded. And then you're going to, you know, just do the mantis attack, shoot, then jump on top of your friend's head, and you're gonna be on top of that window. And then, you're just going to quickly, quickly, you're just going to run jump onto the construction thing, and boom, 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 ba. Yeah, once you're up there, you can jump on the. There's like a barrier right here. I'm gonna show you right now. You can jump on that, and I'm pretty sure once you're in it, uh, you're not knifeable. I don't think you're knifeable in any of these spots, but yeah, there's uh, another thing, another place you can jump to. That's the light post right there. And from there, I, I thought you could jump on the pole because uh, there's like pegs or whatever on the side of the pole, but they're just too high. Even for an RPG jump, they're too high. So you're, you're just either stuck on the lamp post on top of the construction thing or on the window. So there's another one which is like a pretty small one and it's over here you have to do exactly the same thing you did with the two man thing over there on the other side of the map so you just get our friend to stick out here i mean edge out here and then you go to the other window you jump blah, 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 and then you can be on top of the window and that tree over there is buried the tree next to the window it would be cool if it was a uh, I had a legend and so you can jump in it but it's buried off so I I think you can try it but I'm not sure it's something I'm not sure about that uh, pole over there uh, it has pegs just like the other one um, every pole has pegs but those pegs are solid so you might be able to RPG jump here or strafe jump so you guys can try that out because I, I can't try it so there's one that I missed and I'm seeing now that I'm recording the video uh, that I'm editing the video so this one you're just basically going to RPG jump to the light pole and then from the light pole there's like pegs on these windows uh, that I'm showing you right now so you can like strafe jump or RPG jump from the light pole onto those windows uh, you can strafe it because I tried strafing and I, I remember hitting it but then you can like jump from like on each one of those windows because all of them have pegs and on MWR is the there's like a, what's it called? A construction thingy, just like on the other side of the map. Uh, but it basically has a sign, I think, on top of it. And I'm pretty sure that sign is solid and you can stand on it. So you might be able to jump from the pen to the sign. I can't remember how high the sign or anything is. So yeah, but I don't, I don't remember anything on up here. I just wanted to point that out. Now, all the other glitches that I'm gonna be showing you are going to be on like free XP server, whatever the cut jumper thingy, uh, which means uh, it's not old school mode. I'm not going to be showing you the things in old school mode, but you need old school mode to get them Yeah, sorry I don't... So this one on bog might work uh, it might work on beach bog as well I mean they're like the same up just a few other spots, but yeah, there's this weird thing sticking out here and uh, As you guys most likely know you can get on top of that wall over there by just like jumping right what I'm doing I mean, there's no barrier here in God of War, but on the barrier it works for sure. But yeah, you basically jump on that wall and then like do a super delayed RPG strafe. It has to be a sh like a small strafe. It might just be a run jump. But that barrier has like a weird edge where like uh, I'm trying to remember. Uh, you know how patio? When you land on patio, you land like on like the it's basically a barrier where it's not like a flat barrier it just goes like uh it, it's not a flat barrier okay i don't i don't know what i'm trying to explain it's basically not a flat barrier yeah okay okay now the last glitch i got for you guys it's going to be on ambush and this glitch is pretty sick because uh yeah i'm pretty sure no one posted this one at least not the way that uh i found it so basically we landed uh this barrier on rpgs only and, and using a shotgun from down here uh, but I found a way or maybe even two ways to get onto it solo so one includes a, uh, an RPG strafe and one includes just a run jump but you have to edge out really like a lot so you you can do both on hide and seek since uh, ambush has the RPG on hiding on the ultra mode so the first way which is the annoying one is going to be uh, you have to come up here and then edge out as much as you can and you have to find a perfect lineup because just edging out is not going to help so you have to find a perfect lineup and then yeah I'm just, I'm just redoing it because I'm on PC 
the Kajamper mode, but on console it's much more annoying. And as I said, I'm not an old, I'm not an old school mode, so you won't be able to, uh, so, so I won't be able to get there. But once you're an old school, you should be able to get there. So, yeah, that's one way of doing it. And as you can see on this on this game on God 4, there's a barrier on the first window as well. But I'm talking about the second window because I'm I, I don't think there's a barrier. <clears throat> My voice is cutting out. Because I don't think there's a barrier on uh, on the first window on Call on the VR. But yeah, the second one, which requires the RPG, is a uh, RPG straight from right over here. And again, I'm doing it with uh, the respawn thing because uh, it, I mean it's gonna be super annoying to even try on MWR. I just wanted to do a video showing you guys the glitches. So yeah, don't expect these to be easy. They're pretty hard glitches, except those two mans. And the light post is not that hard, but people find it annoying. I think that's why no one posted it, but people find it annoying. So yeah, you have to like uh, RPG strafe around the corner, but like not just around the corner, like a shit ton around the corner, but you have to be really close to the corner when you're in this one, I'm trying to say. Because if you like go far away, then you're just gonna not get enough, enough distance, but if you go too close, you're just gonna hit the corner and fall down. Uh, but yeah, if you land on there, again, as I said, I don't think you're knifeable like on any of these glitches. But you have to do a really good, like, really good strafe or like a really nice run jump from the edge to get it. So yeah, they're pretty hard to, pretty hard to land. I'm just going to leave you guys with all these glitches that I've done. Um, I don't know what you're gonna do with them. If you're gonna try them, if you're just gonna fucking, I don't know, just know they exist, but. Yeah, I wanna go try them out because you're bored of Call of Duty. Like the recent Call of Duty, which is World War II, which is a fucking dead ass game. I don't know the fuck would play that. People still play it, but it's so dead. Like, in my opinion, it's the most boring fucking COD ever, even though I only played the beta. Just watching it so retarded. Just the movement in the game is so slow and annoying. I, I don't know. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy the video, I would appreciate if you could smash the like button. And let's try to go for 100 likes, if possible. Because, uh, I feel good to hit 100 likes finally, after a shit ton of months of not uploading. Because my videos barely fucking hit 100 likes when I post now. Um, uh, but yeah, not that I haven't posted in 5 years, but still, you know. But yeah, I'll come back to the daily posting when... MW Tier Mastered comes out if it comes out, if, it, if that's gonna be this year. And uh, I'm for sure gonna come back when BO4 Beta comes out. Gonna be grinding that shit all day. Uh, I just love the Black Ops game so far, so I have a lot of faith in BO4. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Have a nice day, and I'll talk to y'all later.